Chopin and I are currently on our way to Radio Bakery. It has been a while. I used to go there like every other weekend in <coughs> spring and summer and then I sprained my ankle while I was on my way there and I was like a little bit uh, traumatized to like go. It was just like a little stressful because I had like a very negative experience, not with them, but, like just my like typical ride there. Actually, it is our first time walking over. Um, typically, we took the subway because it is a lot, uh, it's really easy. I mean, it's really short too, but you know, I was like thinking about it, it's only 30 minute walk. But I'm like, oh, maybe I should just walk it since I'll save like five, six dollars from the subway ride. So yeah, we have decided to take this morning as a long walk. Look at all of his fluffiness on his ears. It's so crazy. It's hard for me to be somewhere for too long. I'm always moving around. Shobhan is so confused because we've never <laughs> been on a bridge. And he's like, what is going on? Why am I, where am I? Why am I going on this weird thing? <laughs> also, we have lots of runners right now because everyone's getting ready for the New York City Marathon. We have finally made it across the bridge. We're doing good now. We are across the bridge. The whole time we were on the bridge, Chopin was like, what is that? Because he was, um, he's never been so high up and like seen off of the, um, I guess like a bridge and heard like traffic, but he did great. Now we're going to walk over and I really hope it's not busy, but it's okay. I brought my earphones just in case. The line is shockingly shorter than when I typically come here, which makes me happy. So hopefully it'll stay short. So I got the goods, which makes me happy but um, what I should have realized and this is what I recommend <laughs> if you end up coming is they have time frames that different things come out so for example uh, I think 7 30 is when they open and from 7 30 until they sell out they do all of, like the breakfast stuff and then starting from 10 o'clock is when they have like lunch stuff such as like lunch focaccias and like yeah, things like that. Versus like in the morning focaccias, which by the way, I love the focaccias and that's truly the only reason why I'm going. Um, the breakfast focaccias are more like the smoked salmons, um, the cream cheese, the scallions, which don't get me wrong, I love, but their lunch focaccias are so good. Um, so because I pretty much got in at nine, they were not taking out any of the lunch focaccias yet because those don't come out until 10 a.m. So really, I was getting like what was last left of breakfast stuff. Um, so yeah, I would either get here like earlier, like maybe like 8.30 or earlier, or get here at like 9.45 or like 10 on the nose so that you're getting some of that lunch stuff. Chopin is doing so well, but he's little does he know that we have to go back home the same way that we came, which means back on the bridge. So I am getting ready right now because Eric and I are going to head over to Ridgewood because there is like a little pop-up um, collaboration that's happening. Um, at one of our favorite secondhand furniture stores called Lycan. They are also working with another, um, what would you call it? 
print store, I guess, um, that we really love that's in Chelsea called Printed Matter. And so we're super excited to see what kind of work that they bring. I put my hair up today, which has not been common these days, but we're doing what we can. I am starting off with the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base. It kind of just feels like a moisturizer. Like, I don't really think that it does anything priming wise. I am open to suggestions. I know I have like this big jar, but as soon as I get through this jar, I think I'm gonna like graduate from Vitamin Enriched Face Base. And then I also have the Bobbi Brown uh, Weightless Skin Foundation, which I do want to note that it's actually a really amazing foundation. It really does give like a medium coverage. Um, I am just like a little bit more of like a fuller coverage gal. I think for people who have less blemishes and more like redness that they want to cover, this works really well. But like, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I've been like breaking out a lot these days. Um, and so I have like a lot of dark spots, a lot of red spots, a lot of just like blemishes all over my face. I can't just use this and like cover everything. When the Sephora sale comes, I do have a foundation that I will be buying and I've tested a few shades. I just haven't found the shade. I keep on picking this sh same shade by accident. I don't know why I don't remember the shade that I already have, but I'm gonna get the Huda Beauty Easy Blur. It's just so good. Like, I feel like it really does blur my skin and it like just leaves such a beautiful finish and I won't I'm not gonna lie it's not that different in like the end finish as the weightless skin foundation because this one you also don't really need to set it with powder like it doesn't leave like any like sticky residue I, I almost feel like it like self sets itself um kind of like the huda beauty one does as well but the huda beauty one offers just like this blurring experience that i like really want and need um so that is kind of the next one that i'm trying to get i will say that this color what is this cool ivory it's like the perfect shade match like you can't even it's insane. I'll give them like if I don't ever find a better shade match than the Bobbi Brown, then I might just like maybe I'll just use the Bobbi Brown. It's just like so wild to me. I don't think I've ever found such a good shade match. I mean, they do have 53 shades, so I feel like this is like my go-to look these days. I mean, it's not any different, to be honest, compared to like how I was going before. It's just different products. And so right now I'm testing all these products, seeing if I like them. Now I'm gonna change and we are gonna get ready to go. cute that is and then you can just stick your money in and then lock it and then no one can get into it and then I can save money <laughs> to buy my USF oh my god look how cute this is they have the come on over so cute they put it in this little thing There's a lot of kids coming here. 
lots of cute posters. I mean, we already knew that the furniture here was really cute. Um, but yeah, very, very tempting. I just don't know if you have a space for posters right now. Also doing a pop-up with taco sando so we picked up some sandwiches mm. oh they split it in half that's yeah. amazing um, I can look at that also. So oh it's okay do we need napkins oh I have my wet wipe wet, 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 wet wipes <laughs> this is the tonkatsu and then that's the chicken Oh, but it's like a Japanese pickle, right? Yeah. That's like different, you know? Yeah, it's different.